New police body cam footage shedding some light on an officer involved death of 17 year old Judson Album last March and whether officers knew the teen had an airsoft gun and not a real gun. News Channel 9's Madison Moore tells us what the video show moments before the teen was shot and killed by police. A warning, some may find the video disturbing. Judson Elbum's mother, Carissa, called 911 during the noon hour last March after her son had run away from a mobile crisis unit trying to take him to psychiatric emergency treatment. As officers rushed to find Album, they were told he owned airsoft guns and had threatened suicide by cop in the past. Body cam footage from six officers on the scene show an on foot chase through the neighborhood. Is that him right there? Okay. In multiple videos, officers can be heard saying they see Album and that he appears to be holding a black handgun. Buddy, I don't want to kill you. We want to help you, man. Right, right, right there. He had a pistol. He had, he had a what appeared to be a pistol in his hand. Yeah. He held it down to his side the whole time that last time. Album was in a wooded area when police moved in. He's running towards the top of the hill. I can see him. And then you hear this. Shots fired by four officers from three different agencies after they say Album pointed his weapon at them. Grab cover, grab cover. Get down, grab cover. After those shots were fired, EMS was called to the scene and officers attempted life saving measures on Album. He was pronounced dead at the scene. The four officers who fired their weapons were not wearing body cameras at the time of the shooting. Christy? Madison, thank you. The AG's office says the release of the video was only to provide more transparency to the public. No one has been charged in the shooting.